Is a skull cap mandatory for the Salah to be accepted? No, this is a cultural thing. And the biggest example and the biggest proof of that is when you are wearing your ihram and it's time to pray. Do you cover your head with a skull cap? Definitely not. And if you do, you have to expiate for violating your ihram. So a skull cap is a cultural thing. And in Arabia, this is a cultural thing that I'm wearing. If I take it off and pray, no problem. When does it become an innovation? It becomes an innovation when 24-7, I have nothing on my head. I wear a t-shirt, I wear a suit, and nothing is on my head. Only when I come to the masjid and I want to pray, I take a handkerchief. And some of the subcontinent, they are professionals in tying it and doing it on their head. Or I take my kufi, skull cap. In Turkey, you enter the masjid and you find a box where you take one. I don't know if there are fleas or I don't know, but this is what they do. And they wear it only for the salat. And when they leave, they take it off. This is an innovation. It's not part of the religion at all. But if you wear it 24-7, if, if this is your culture or your custom that you always wear a skull cap, not for the uh, uh, prayer, but uh, throughout the whole day, there's no problem in that.